Ouch. So you guys were shitty doctors, huh? I mean, I'm not a doctor, but I don't think you're supposed to stab your patients. Unless you run out of patients. Ha <laughs> ha! With your patients. That's a joke. Looks like that's the only thing. Oh, no, nope, oh, that way. How do I get across there, though? Great question. I don't think I can make it to that pole. There's gotta be another way. Okay. Other way. Looks about right. Just gotta. Okay. Uh, um. Fucking pull. <laughs> Whew, did not feel like climbing all that again. You know, I'm gonna have to anyway, once I have the other power source. What? And the body, a vessel to hold these sparks. But it is weak. In time, it decays and crumbles into dust. Just like a lot of things. Like everything. Nothing lasts forever. We <clears throat> ask ourselves then, what if it might be replaced with something stronger? Something better? So we forged a new vessel. One that might endure. It proved easy enough to enter. Well, where'd this bitch go? To believe required something more. Something wrong. And so this too they abandoned. I wondered though. Were they right to turn away? place makes me uncomfortable. Boop. I have no idea where I'm going or what I'm doing, but I'm making progress. Looks to be the last thing. Or is that thing I landed on before? Hard to tell. Nope. Yep, here's the desk. Till next time. Till then. Back to Cutter. You got anything to say now, old man? Oh, all right. Back to the machine, baby. I pressed the A button. Ooh, look at that. I found a third power source. What? Already. It popped up in an earlier search, but I've only just managed to confirm it. Where? There's a museum in Cairo with one on display. Guess Connor will have to wait. No, you stay. We need to find that key, and time is running out. I'll make the trip. What about Cross? Everything's going to be fine. I'll be back soon. No, oh, he's gonna die. Ready when you are, Desmond. He's gonna make the trip alone. Nonetheless. Winter approaches. The air is still and sharp with grim expectation. The others sense it too and go about their work with uncommon urgency. I would like to help them, but more pressing matters now demand my attention. The Templars have targeted George Washington directly and will not rest until he is dead. I had hoped to shield him from this knowledge, but Thomas Hickey ended any hope I had of staying silent. And so I have resolved to share everything I know of the Templars and their plots, of who I really am. Achilles finds fault in this 
and we argue every day. But there is simply too much now at stake to maintain restraint. 1777. I'm Oracle's a country now. Don't do this, Kala. Then what would you propose we do? Sit and watch while the Templars take control? We are sworn to stop them, or have you forgotten? Assassins are meant to be quiet, precise. We do not go announcing conspiracies from the rooftops to all who pass by. Who are you to lecture anyone? You locked yourself away in this crumbling heap and gave up on the Brotherhood entirely. Since the day I arrived, you've done nothing but discourage me. And on the rare occasions you've chosen to help, you've done so little, you may as well have done nothing at all. Did he save your life? You. Then tell me, on whose watch did the Brotherhood falter? Whose inaction allowed the Templar Order to grow so large that it now controls an entire nation? If I sought to dissuade you, it was because you knew nothing. If I was reluctant to contribute, it was because you were naive. A thousand times you would have died and taken God knows how many with you. Let me tell you something, Kala. Life is not a fairy tale, and there are no happy endings. No. Not when men like you are left in charge. Stubborn as fuck, man. In your haste to save the world, boy, take care you don't destroy it. Ha! Ha! Ah. Man, how do you have nothing? Like, I don't understand how you can be so mean to that guy. Been living with him for so long. Probably come like your father figure, yeah. But I guess we all treat our fathers with some disrespect. And our mothers, as they treat us with some too. It's just human nature to be a dick. Yeah, can I just teleport? Is that cool? Uh, no, because I'm not going anywhere yet. Fuck you, tree. Up, 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 horsey style. Ah, uh, really? This was Skyrim. You be fucking fine. Well, don't make me walk. Don't make me walk. Made me walk. Yeah, cold water. Freezing water. Beard water. Cold freezing bed. No? Okay. Just seems logical as well that that water would hurt me. But I guess I'm just an idiot who thinks that water and the cold is not something you should be swimming in. Shut up, bitch. What do you think is about to happen, buddy? I don't suppose the armory is here, is it? Anywhere? To be honest, I don't really know where the armory is. Okay, guess not. I'm just tired carrying this big ass axe. Oh, it's fun to kill people with. I'll give it that. And it is kind of a trophy. From that one guy. On that boat. Was it on a boat? Was it on a boat, was it? No, that was when I was fighting with Pierre Nevins or whatever. I think we pretty sure it was then. Your face! Hey. Are you sleeping? Okay, whatever. Weird place to sleep, but who am I to judge? An assassin. That's who I am. Look. 
ledge, ledge climbing, here I come, la di da di da. Fancy living, here we come, la da 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 da. Yes, I do think you will catch me. Probably cause you'll be dead! <laughs> okay. Get something to say? Uh oh. Ah, it's fun to kill people. <laughs> oh shit. Nope. Also dead. Well, it's not like killing the dogs. So dogs, let me alone. Okay. Nope. Okay. Keep dying. Listen, you're the ones attacking. I'm just trying to continue on with my adventure. You're making all your friends go to waste here, so. Could you please get out of that tree? Um. Alright, whatever. Stay there. Can't kill you. I can't. Are you moving? Did you move? Sorry, friend. Now I make you naked. <sighs> Time to make you all very, very naked. Yama. I wonder. That, I wonder what that means. Yama. 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 Yam. Wow. Well, I got the fangs. Stupid wolves. Should've known. Should've known not to fuck with me, cause my name's Connor, yes siree. And I'll kill you with my tomahawk, then you will be... Fucking get out of here. I'm not trying, skin animals. Now I am. Yeah, I'm out. Yeah, we know. This place is fucking far. Oh, fuck off, wolf. Fucking wolves. You're just slowing me down, you annoying ass fuckers. This mountain should not be possible to climb from this angle. At least I don't think it should be. But, again, I'm not an assassin. Don't care about the viewpoint. Are you kidding me? The snow shall ease my pain. See? Didn't even feel anything. I feel bad for that horse I abandoned. He's probably dead by now. Frozen. Or eaten by wolves. Or both. Or eaten by wolves and pooped out and then having the poop frozen. Deer must die! Ah, the deer lives today. Ah, 
They make these things too far away sometimes. And the horse is too glitchy. No, it's a bad Connor. I'm fine. Just my bones. They're just broken. Don't care about hunting. Just don't care about hunting. Really do not care about hunting. Almost there. By almost, I mean halfway. Meaning that there's another painful, like, four minutes of my awkward commentary. Oh no, we're at the bridge. So, we should be close. Can rabbits survive in the winter? Like, just chilling out? I don't think they need it. I guess not. Hmm. What's that rabbits need it? I know bears do. <clears throat> I think it's possible for human beings to hibernate. To eat, like, a ton of food. And then just go to sleep for, like, six months. Probably not. Stomachs probably can't contain that much food. They'd probably get sick, vomit out the food. But again, again, I'm no doctor. Maybe we can. There we go. And it only took us like two minutes. Now we're still not there yet, so I'm just rounding off two minutes. It's been like a minute since I said anything about minutes before. <sighs> What's up, peeps? I need to say I need to see my boy GW. I'm not talking about George W. Bush, fuck it, George Washington. At least I think that's what I'm going to see. I really don't know. Whatever it is, I found him though. Looks like George Washington from here. Whew. Commander. Mr. President. Connor. Any word on Lee? Not yet. My apologies. I've been distracted. Bye. Supply caravans meant for the camp have gone missing. Oh no! I suspect treachery. Not treachery. Treachery. A traitor named Benjamin Church, recently released from prison, has vanished as well. The two events are surely related. What was his crime? He was caught sending letters to the loyalists. Detailing our troop strength. He claimed it was a scare tactic. That we might avoid war. A poor lie. I will find church for you. Thank you. Why? What reason have you to help? I like America. Does it matter? As you wish. We've received reports of trouble along the southern road. Might be he's responsible. <laughs> I suggest you begin your search there. Or here. Or anywhere. Or underwear. Benjamin Church. More like Benjamin, I'm gonna fucking kill him. Damn this snow. You look pretty, but you make me move slow. Damn this snow. 
You may look pretty, but you make me look slow. Look slow. Move slow. Oh no, move slow. I'm mixing my words and now I can't rap no more. Or at all, ever to begin with, because I 